Friday morning. I have nothing going on today, so I'm gonna film a full day of eating for you guys. Since I'm reverse dieting back up from my show weight, I am still kind of at lower carb, uh, like lower macro type diet, so keep that in mind when you watch my full days of eating that like I am eating kind of uh, still pretty low for like, a maintenance diet. Uh, just because I don't want to put on weight too fast and I want to take it slow in my reverse so I'm building my calories back up from that low show diet so yeah I just wanted to like say that to keep that in mind um, because I do eat a lot of like low carb things but for the most part my breakfast is the same I am so uncreative with breakfast because I found a breakfast that I'm so in love with I can't really stop eating it because it's just my favorite thing so sorry that that's very um uncreative and you guys basically see the same breakfast every video but um it is really good so if you want to fall in love with the breakfast i suggest you try this one but um anyway so yeah i don't know what else is going to be in this video uh besides the full day of eating and obviously a workout but hopefully you guys will enjoy it and i'll see you in the next clip <laughs> Alright guys, sorry there's nothing new with my breakfast here. I just did one packet of Oat Fit Oatmeal, half a cup of egg whites cooked in, and one tablespoon of peanut butter. And of course some coffee. Alright guys, so I'm gonna make a snack now. I ate breakfast like three hours ago, so I'm gonna do a PB&J with rice cakes. Um, I'm going to do plain rice cakes. I'm going to use sugar-free jelly and PB2, the powdered peanut butter, and just make it with water into like a spread. So I'm just going to do two rice cakes and peanut butter and jelly on both. One serving of this, so it's gonna be 12 grams of the powder. Okay, so the last clip didn't record, but I put one serving of jelly on, um, I split it in half, obviously, half and half of one serving on each, and then I'm just gonna add the peanut butter now. Alright guys, so Anthony's gone for the day and I got nothing to do so I'm going to head to the pool and relax for a little bit. Now that my show day tan is gone, it's like really depressing to be super pale so um, I'm going to go try to get some color. I'm just bringing my BCAAs apple juice flavor i really was a big lemonade advocate but i think i like apple juice even better it literally tastes like you're drinking apple juice just like not as sugary all right so bcaa's um i'm about to head down here now i'll take you guys with me and show you my pool area i've never had a pool before like as a kid i never had one growing up so like i'm kind of loving having one in my complex um, this suit is from Zawful, that um, overseas website, and people ask me all the time because I bought like seven suits, so any bathing suit I've been posting recently has been from Zawful, and it takes forever, like don't order them thinking you'll have them for a vacation or something because they really might not come in time. I think I waited like six to eight weeks to get all of them, and they all came like separately, like one at a time, but they were like seven dollars each so you can't really complain so I just kind of bought them and then forgot about it and then once they came it was like oh I got a bathing suit so yeah I mean the quality is obviously not amazing but um, it's so freaking cheap that like you can't even pass it up so I personally recommend um, buying a few suits they make like really freaking cute ones and they make like replicas of really expensive ones so yeah 
I'm a big fan. It takes forever to ship. The quality is not that great, but like for seven to fifteen dollars per suit, it's like I don't know what else you could expect. That's the way it was. It was good on the low for a fatty fuck. On some fatty love. She what the fuck you could pay for. Feeling daddy love. You used to trip off that shit. I was kicking to you. Had some fun on the run, girl. I'll give it to you, but baby. chicken um like half a cup of broccoli and cauliflower mash i've been literally loving the cauliflower mash lately so again this is not the most creative thing you guys have seen this already but it's really freaking good so yeah i'm gonna make that now and i'll show you guys once it's done and i also tried the adobo um seasoning that everybody like talks about it's zero calorie and all that um it tastes really good though so i'm gonna put this on as well once it's finished. I'm gonna take my pre-workout, Megawatt V2, Blue Raz flavor. They actually just dropped the strawberry kiwi today. Anthony took it with him, so I can't show you guys, but that flavor is literally so good. So, try that one out as well, but I'm a big Blue Raz fan um, of anything. So, yeah, I'm gonna head to the gym. I'm gonna train back, and I will film it for you guys, so you'll be seeing that in the next few clips, and I hope that you guys enjoy it. I just got 92 so I think I'm gonna do three ounces of that 
I think three servings of egg whites and then I got this vegetable medley um, rice cauliflower like veggie medley mix or whatever so I'm gonna try this in there as well probably do a cup of this so I'll show you guys that once it's finished so I'm just gonna throw everything in the frying pan all right so so far we have the egg whites and the beef kind of looks really disgusting but it's really good all right so that is everything and I just put some more adobo seasoning on it um, but yeah, so that's gonna be my dinner. Alright guys, so I'm all showered. I'm back in my comfy sweatshirt. Um, I'm just gonna finish off my night with protein ice cream, but I still don't have level 1 protein, so I'm gonna use Quest again. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna make that. I haven't shown you guys that in a while. It's literally just a, um, a scoop of protein, 8 ounces of cashew milk, um, and like 6-ish ice cubes and some xanthan gum so i'll show you guys that and i was supposed to have like a lot of toppings and stuff on it but i fucked up earlier and i ate two oreos can we just this is what i live with we like literally hoard goodies and yeah i caved today so i screwed myself and now i can't really have much on top of my ice cream but that's okay but yeah i'm gonna be making that right now so i'll show you guys that in the next clip all right so we have a scoop of protein in there i'm gonna add the cashew milk now i use unsweetened 25 calories per cup so xanthan gum this just makes it like thick and it gives it like that ice cream consistency instead of just like a regular protein shake so I usually do like half a teaspoonish or a tablespoon I don't know whatever you want to call it and I'm just gonna do about six ice cubes all right so this is the consistency it's literally like soft serve and I'm just gonna add some puffed wheat cereal to it, probably like half a serving, and then just a couple chocolate chips. But that's gonna be about it for my night. Okay, so that is my protein ice cream and the last thing on my full day of eating. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this.